Hello, and in this video, you're going to learn how to make these awesome reusable cards with Tailwind CSS and React. As you can see, they have a moving gradient and are fully mobile responsive. And without further ado, let's begin. All right, so here we have our basic beat app. And what we're going to start with is going to our components folder and creating the service section dot JSX. We can run REFC over here. If you can't do that, you can go to extensions and install this extension to be able to use these kind of snippets. Otherwise, we'll also create a new file called service card.jsx. This will be our reusable card component in our file. We can also run RAFC over here. First thing we can do is collapse the file and folder structure and make all the imports in the service section. First of all, we'll import the service card and also we'll import all of the images. Now the images are simply three icons. I have them in my assets folder and actually I got them from this website. We can also open our terminal by clicking view and terminal and saying npm run dev to run our local host server. So we can go into our local host over here and here is the website. However, what we don't have is the service section because we haven't imported over here yet. So we can say service section and it will automatically import it over here like this. So now everything should work. And the service section is here. Next, we can go back into the service section and start working on it. First of all, we'll actually make this a section and give it some class names. First of all, we'll give it a background of bg-gradient-2-r from dash purple dash 800 to dash indigo dash 800 padding bottom of 300 pixels and padding y of 16 like this. Next inside of here, we can create a div. So we can say div. This div is going to have a class name of max dash w dash seven XL MX dash auto to center it padding X dash four on small devices padding X dash six and on large devices padding X dash eight. In here, we can create another div. This will have a short class name of simply text dash center. And in here, we can create our titles. So an H1 that will say our services. We can also style this H1, which will say class name, text dash three XL, font dash extra bold, and text dash white. Under here, we can have a P tag, which will say, we offer a variety of services. And this P tag will also have a class name of modern top dash four, text dash Excel and text dash gray dash 300 to make it slightly grayish. So now we can go over here and create the wrapper div for our cards. This will be fully mobile responsive and you can have more than three cards. So you can say class name modern top dash 12 this is going to be a grid a grid with only one column. However, on medium devices, it's going to be grid dash calls dash two and on large devices. Grid dash calls dash three. Over here, we'll house our service cards, but obviously we still need to make them. So we'll leave this blank for now. We can go into the service card and in here, we can first accept some props. The props are going to be title, text, and image. We can first work on the JSX. So this can still be a div with a class name of rounded dash LG shadow dash SM planet dash background dash one. We still haven't created this 
and cursor dash pointer. We could also add a class name here of padding dash six. And in here, what we can do is create a div, which will have a class name of flex items dash center justify dash center w dash 12 h dash 12 bg dash indigo dash 800 or the 500 is better and rounded dash md this is the wrapper for our image so we can say image source equals image so the image that we get from props it will have a class name of w-60%. So we'll take up 60% of this div. Then it will have a brightness of zero and invert like this. Now we can finish up this part by going over here and adding an h3, which will have a class name of modern top-4 text dash lg font dash medium text dash gray dash 900 so practically black and over here we can simply say the title under here we'll have a p tag with the text so this will be text and the class name will be also quite simple, modern top dash two, text dash SM and text dash gray dash 300. So white and slightly grayish. Now we can move on to the final part of our application. First of all, you can go to index.css and paste in this plant's background. I will have a GitHub gist for it. I generated this part using ChatGPT and you can do as well. It's a simply a uh, complicated gradient. And so we can also finalize our service section by using all of the service cards. So we can say service card, which we have already imported. And we can add some titles and texts. So we can say title equals say digital marketing. The text will be our digital marketing strategies help boost your online presence and reach and we can also have an image equals user or rather users i believe that is and we can do a similar thing with the other two service cards so I filled in all of the titles and texts, save some time. And over here we have our cards with the icons, titles, and descriptions. Now all we need to do is make this gradient move on mouse move. So now what we can do is go to our service card and over here say const handle mouse move equals event and do it like this. Over here in this div, we can say on mouse move, handle mouse move. In this function, we can say const planet background equals event dot current target, current target. So next we can do is say const client x and client y are both equal to event. Also we can say const mouse x equal client x minus left divided by the width and const mouse y equals client y minus the top and divided by the height. Also, we can say const background pause x equals mouse x times 
50 and const background pause y equals mouse y times 50. The final thing we need to do is say client background dot style dot background position position and say it's equal to a template string like this background pause x percentage sign background pause y and percentage sign so let's see if this worked as you can see the background is in fact moving so we're fully complete with our cards with all of our text and images and also a moving gradient background if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe thank you